Welcome to CVPR 2023. It is a pleasure to present our CVPR papers from the TUM Visual Computing Lab as well as our amazing collaborators. See you there and enjoy watching. We present panoptic lifting for 3D scene understanding with neural fields. With the availability of large-scale labeled 2D data and advances in model architectures, state-of-the-art 2D panoptic segmentation methods perform well, even for images in the wild. However, when applied on multiple views from a scene, they can exhibit issues like inconsistencies in predictions across views. Furthermore, the instance labels are not valid across views. Our method, panoptic lifting, tackles this problem by directly lifting 2D machine-generated labels to a 3D representation. Given only RGB images of a scene, we first pre-process the images to obtain poses and machine-generated 2D segmentations using an off-the-shelf model. We then optimize a volumetric neural scene representation that can be queried for the color, density, semantic, and instance labels for each point in space. Once optimized, our representation can render novel views and their panoptic segmentations. We present DIFF-RF, a novel approach for 3D radiance field diffusion with rendering guidance. In contrast to existing diffusion-based methods, we operate directly on radiance fields enabling unconditional synthesis and novel conditional tasks like massed radiance field completion using the strong synthesis prior learned by our model. During training, our model takes as input a radiance field generated from a set of posed images. Similar to 2D diffusion, we train a time-conditioned 3D unit to reverse a Gaussian noising process, which corrupts the input radiance field over time. Given a corrupted radiance field at a certain time step, the unit is trained to predict the noise applied at that step. We then use the predicted noise to estimate the original radiance field, render it to a set of views, and apply an image reconstruction loss together with a standard diffusion error. This process biases the model towards generating radiance fields that can be rendered to high-quality images. At inference time, we apply ancestral sampling, where we gradually denoise from complete noise to samples from the underlying data distribution. We present a novel method for high-resolution face appearance capture from polarized smartphone images. We propose a new capture setup consisting of a smartphone and inexpensive polarization foils to reconstruct high-quality geometry and appearance textures of human faces in a home capture scenario. The output of our method can be used in standard rendering frameworks to produce photorealistic relighting imagery. Using a smartphone equipped with polarization foils, we capture cross-polarized and parallel-polarized images of a subject. In a pre-processing step, we color calibrate the smartphone camera with a Macbeth chart. Using structure from motion, we estimate the coarse geometry of the subject, to which we then non-rigidly fit the flame face model. Based on this data, and leveraging the fact that the light source is co-located with the camera, we optimize high-resolution diffuse, specular, and normal maps. Specifically, we propose a two-step photometric optimization. Using the cross-polarized data, we recover the diffuse and an initial normal map of the subject using a coarse-defined optimization procedure. We then recover the specular map and refine the normal map using the parallel polarized images. We present object match, robust registration using canonical object correspondences. Object match is a new semantic object-centric approach to camera post estimation for RGBD registration. Classical camera pose estimation relies on feature matching over overlapping regions of frame pairs. This causes such classical feature matching approaches to fail in very low to zero overlap cases, such as the frame pair shown here. 
we instead observe that registration can nonetheless be achieved by leveraging indirect correspondences over semantically matching frames, for instance, for this chair seen from both the back and from the side. Using indirect correspondences over the semantically matching chair, our method can still estimate the camera poses. We present a new approach to learn 3D scene priors with 2D supervision. Without requiring any 3D data, our method learns both semantic and geometric scene priors from multi-view RGB images. We represent a 3D scene as a latent vector from which we can decode to a sequence of objects characterized by their class categories, 3D bounding boxes, and meshes. Learning such a general scene prior supports many downstream applications, including scene synthesis, scene interpolation, and single-view scene reconstruction. Here is an overview of our method. Our 3D scene prior is learned by optimizing for a mapping from a latent space to a manifold of 3D scene. Each random vector sampled from the latent space is decoded into a sequence of objects. We train this generation process guided by our view loss with differentiable rendering. Here, we demonstrate the applicability of our scene prior to downstream applications. We sample in our latent space to synthesize novel scenes. By interpolating between vectors on the latent space, we can achieve scene interpolation between samples. We present neural parametric head models for learning high-quality representations of complete human heads. Given a point cloud, parametric face models can reconstruct plausible human faces. Common approaches such as the basal face model and flame achieve this through PCA on a fixed mesh topology. We propose a neural method that is capable of generating high-quality reconstructions of complete human heads. A core quality of our model is the ability to represent a wide variety of identities. Here we show interpolations in the learned shape parameter space. Similarly, interpolating between our learned expression codes while keeping the identity parameters fixed yields realistic facial movements while maintaining the identity of the person.